We all know that the music made by frogs and toads is for courtship. <whistles> Reptiles also make a lot of sounds, but not always for mating purposes. Among the largest range of sounds made by reptiles are those of crocodilians, such as the American alligator. Alligators vocalize at all ages and sizes and for different reasons. Baby alligators begin calling their mother to come open the nest while they are still in the egg. During their first several months, juvenile alligators make squeaking sounds if they feel in danger, calling to their mother for protection. The deep booming of a bull alligator stakes his territorial claim, and similar rumblings come from adult females on some occasions. Everyone knows that rattlesnakes produce a startling sound by vibrating their tail when they feel threatened. Tail vibration is common in many large terrestrial snakes, even those without rattles, such as rat snakes, corn snakes, and racers, and can effectively create a rattlesnake sound when the tail is in dead leaves or twigs. Another sound that some think is similar to that of a rattlesnake is the loud, defensive hiss of a pine snake, which can be heard from several feet away. Likewise, hognose snakes sometimes hiss when they feel in danger. Learning that reptiles can produce a repertoire of sounds adds to the intrigue of this fascinating group of animals. This is Whit Gibbons reminding you that the great outdoors is the foundation of all life on Earth, including yours. Do your part by supporting ARC, the Amphibian and Reptile Conservancy. Mm -hmm.